Hey everyone, Lucas here, and we are going to start the regular season for the Florida Panthers and Florida Panthers 2015-16 season rewritten as we face off against the Philadelphia Flyers. So let's go ahead and get this going. All right. Nice piece to start. Would be nice to greatly start with a win on this early season. Get off to a good start. Especially like we saw last season. Philadelphia did win their first game of the year. So they definitely have some energy going on their part. And we lost. So Early season loss for the Cats, losing at 6-2. Not the start Florida wanted at all. Giving up 51 shots. The defense definitely not there. Getting up four goals in the second period. As Loretto Lalongo has a rough game. Uh, power play sucked, and then the penalty kill was not that great. So, again, I'm not going to panic. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and keep on rolling. You know, hopefully we can get a uh, win in the next game. It's only the first game. Teams have lost uh, their season openers before and ended up rebounding quite nicely. Uh, Tampa Bay won in one. Buffalo lost both of their games in, over, in OT. Boston starting off 2-0. and It's not what uh, Florida wants to see. All right, so here we go. Let's uh, go ahead and face off against Philly. Uh, I have been received a trade offer. Austin Barassa. Hmm. 22 of age, right winger. Wow, 20. Hmm. But he's still young, though. Still in the AHL. I'm not going to respond to that right now. That trade. I'll wait off and just finish up today. <laughs> but that could be a decent trade for us. All right, boys, let's win this game. You know, started off the year with a loss, but it's got the kid's got character of 10, but his potential is only three stars, so I don't see it being good. All right, there we go. Big win. Went four to three. What we needed 40 shots. Uh, Bukestad with a goal. Uh, we just exploded. Keith Yandel, his first goal. Jokinen, Howden. All with goals. So Weiss, his first assist as a Florida Panther. Great win. I'll take it. Uh, power play sucked again. Might have to make a couple of moves over there. Uh, let's go ahead. So Montoya will be in net tonight for the Cats. And I'm probably going to get Thornton out. I don't want him playing more than... You know, he needs to. Master Petrovic. Uh, okay, so I think what I'm going to do. Row, one, two, three, four. So we have to put in Quentin Howden's in, Hubido, Jokin in. Bukestad, Mackenzie, Peary is in, Kyle Rouse in, Maurice Yager. Uh, I'm going to have to send someone uh, down, but who? Who do I send down? Well, Garrett Wilson will play. Ah, no, that's it. That's it. I just will uh, address him. And I will sit down. Thornton. Oh, yeah. 
uh, scratch player, and then put in Wilson. All right. So move Howden to there, and we'll put Garrett Wilson at left wing. And again, I kind of want to. I like this line or the young line, the fourth Wilson, Rao, and Howden. So let's go ahead and play that one. All right, face, face off against Carolina. Carolina, oh, one and one. We're one and one. Nice to get a win here. Uh, currently sitting 11th in the Eastern Conference. All right, there we go. Got a win, two to one over the Carolina Hurricanes, facing off against Buffalo, who actually has not lost a game in regulation. Huberto two assists. Um, Montoya, great game, dropping Carolina winless on the season yet still. So we'll keep this up. Uh, Bukestad, a power play goal. There we go, power play goal. Finally for the Cats, two power play goals. Penalty kill not as strong. Though, but we will definitely take it. So let's go ahead and now sim to uh, next game uh, against Buffalo. But I have to put Longo in net. Longo will be in next. Uh, All right. So fourth in the the Atlantic Division at two and one. Boston two and one. Montreal two and two. Tampa three and one. Currently, the winless teams in the Eastern Conference this is Carolina, Washington, Columbus. In the West, it's Minnesota. All right, here we go. So let's go ahead and put Longo in net for this one. And finish today. All right, be nice to get, go 3 and 1 after that tough loss against Philly in the home opener and season opener. Be nice to get, strain off 30 wins in a row. Again, nice to be, it would be nice to have a 500 plus record without Barkov in before he comes back. It really would be nice to see that. So let's see what Florida does. Excellent big win against Buffalo, five to one win. Uh, definitely will take it. Keith Yandel, two assists. Roberto Longo, thirty-three shots saved. Uh, Mackenzie a goal and assist. Only ten thousand. Come on, you guys can do better than that. Uh, Kyle Rao with a goal. I like that. I like to see that. Uh, only power play. Chance we got, we scored. Penalty kill, perfect. All right, I like to see that. Let me go ahead and check my messages. Thornton. Oh, Sean Thornton. Oh. Oh. Four weeks. That might hurt. San Jose with a trade. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Um, Continue this on until next game. Currently sitting third in the elected division, which would qualify us for a playoff spot. Subban. Wow. So he's taken over. Wow. Subban for uh, Boston is taking off goaltending. Yeah, he's got three wins. I wonder what happened to Rask. Interesting. I did see Bukestad leading points. All right, so here we go against Dallas. Uh, Dallas two and two on the year. Florida hoping to get a another win tonight against the Dallas Stars and prove to four and one on the season. And win their fourth straight game in a row. Oh, three goals. 
Like every game had three goals or more in yesterday's game, pretty much. Interesting. That's, I think that's. I don't know why that old Stars logo does it on this pack that they put out. It's weird. Yes, another win, five to two over the Stars. Great win for the Cats. Uh, Hubido with a goal and assist. Bukestad two assists. Kulikov two goals and an assist. Wow, that has to be a career high. He wanted to revenge over uh, that. Uh, a couple of seasons ago against the Dallas Stars when they actually told dicks to him. Uh, Riley Smith, again, a two-assist game. Uh, Kulikov, oh, that's awesome. But yeah, he has, his game rating is 90. And Keith Yandles is 100, and he only had an assist. How, how's that happen? Quentin Howard, not a good game. Wow, only two power play chances that whole entire game. And they did not come until the third period. Cool. Um, okay, so here we go. Till next game. I think Barkov should be back now for this game. Florida now first in the Atlantic Division. After again just starting off on a poor loss. Roberto Longo is sixth in wins in the league. So currently, uh, Carolina is winless. And then you have Minnesota winless. And those are the only two winless teams. The only undefeated team in the league is the Anaheim Ducks, as they are 4-0. So we got... Yeah, it'll be good to get. Barkov is ready to return. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. All right. So, unfortunately, Howden, you had a goal and an assist. I got to check. Wilson, you had an assist. Uh, Kyle Rao, you had a goal. Weiss is a goal and assist, but I want to keep Weiss, so I'm probably going to send Kyle Rao back down to the minors. As much as I don't want to do that, I'm going to. But again, you did play a great game. Uh, you're great for us when you are. Now, Barkov is back, though, so obviously pff, he's obviously going to get the um, starting lineup. All right. Uh, I haven't played Petrovic yet. I might play Petrovic. Wilson, Kulikov, Campbell, Yandel, Ekblad. I just, I don't know. I just don't think Petrovic is really going to get much playing time. Unless I sit, I'll probably sit Mitchell a couple of games. Because I just don't, Mitchell just sucks. I'll probably give Mitchell a rest like every now and then. When, uh, I could have kept Rao up. But whatever. I'm not going to stress about it right now because I've got Barkov back and that's all that matters. So Mackenzie, Weiss, uh, Bukestad, and then Barkov. In your rightful place. So I'm going to have then Barkov. Not waste on the power play. I will have uh, Weiss, though, be on the penalty kill. Maybe. Probably not. Yeah. Well, my penalty kill is doing decent. So I guess I'll put him in on the power play there. And then I'll take out Yager. On the shootouts, even though we haven't had any shootouts yet. All right, so there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna sim now till the next game against Pittsburgh. First in the Atlantic. Keep it up. Carolina still winless through five games, so. Uh, and there are currently no undefeated teams left in the NHL. So, 
there was that. All right, here we go against Pittsburgh. October 20th. It's moving quite nicely in this season, in this month so far of October. Yeah, my goal is to hopefully do at least um, a month per session. Again, I don't want to make these over excessively long. So we'll see how far I get. Oh, we beat Pittsburgh. There we go. Another win. Five wins in a row from the Florida Panthers uh, in this season. So, all right, 1540. Uh, again, I know I really don't want that to show, but, hey, it is what it is. Uh, trade between Buffalo. So I'll probably do a couple more games. Ooh, Ovechkin is out for the Capitals. Three weeks. That is definitely, definitely going to hurt. But overall, a great win for the Cats over Pittsburgh. Uh, Huberto, three assists. Uh, Barkov comes back. Two goals. Yes, this is what I'm talking about. Uh, Gandel, another goal. Awesome. How's the power play and the penalty kill? Power Penalty kill, not good. So, um, hmm. I might have to swap some lines out because that is definitely not what I wanted as penalty kill. So, maybe I will put Weiss in uh, as a penalty kill unit specialist. Um, and then and maybe move up Trocheck with. Bukestad and switch Bukestad over with Howden. Um, so rosters, I'm going to sit. I'm gonna um, sit Mitchell. Now scratch Mitchell and put in Petrovic for this next game. See how well he can do. Have him uh, be with um, Campbell. And then, uh, Petrovic on the left defense. And Petrovic on the penalty kill. But I'll probably move Yandel right up there. Okay. So, okay, that's good. All right. Till next game. All right, here we go. So I think this, this will be the last game, this game against Chicago. Again, I don't want these to be overly excessively long. We'll go over the stats real quick. Number one, the Atlantic. Take it. Five straight wins for the Cats. Facing off against Chicago. Um, now, I do want to check out these stats real quick. I want to check the power play and the um, penalty kill. Okay, so here we go. Uh, team stats. I want to check the penalty kill real quick. Okay, so the power play percentage. We currently are down the bottom. Where are we? Florida, 20th. Not great, but not bad. Penalty kill, definitely is probably going to be down at the bottom. 22nd, so it's okay. Um, home attendance, home average, you're probably dead, dead last, really. Come on, man. We're better than this. 57. Of course, it's doing it as real time, whatever. Uh, but anyways, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I'm looking forward to doing uh, the rest of October into the uh, month of November. So again, guys, thanks.